Good evening. And first, I do want to express my deep appreciation for those who have worked to secure this building and safeguard our democracy. So help you, God. So help me, God. Congratulations, Mr. Thank President. You. The American Rescue Plan. The bill includes direct stimulus payments, $1,400 checks for many Americans, as well as a $130 billion investment in school reopening and an expanded child tax credit. We need to make sure that we swing hard uh, and that we can't afford to look backwards and be, uh, be uh, regretful of not having done enough. The opportunity that we have with this child tax credit allows people to be able to turn that those resources towards things like child care to make sure that they can then earn an income. Uh, and those are those things that I think are revolutionary and game changers. But Chester County also experienced serious damage as the remnants of Ida moved into that region. I'm coming to you from Phoenixville where I've just had the opportunity to tour uh, the damage that has been done by Hurricane Ida and the destruction that has uh, been left behind. I have been in contact with the governor as well as FEMA and FEMA to make sure that we're working as quickly as we can to get people the help that they need. Congresswoman Chrissy Houlihan stepped by to give them a congressional commendation. The team won the title with a win over Archbishop Wood last month in Hershey. Thank you to frontline workers, teachers, essential workers, postal workers, and others who have selflessly worked so hard. Bridges, transit systems, and airports around here and across the country are aging. They need repair or replacement. Congresswoman Chrissy Houlihan, who represents parts of Berks and Chester counties, says failure to deliver on infrastructure is not an option. Pennsylvania is slated to get more than $11 billion for roads and more than $1.5 billion for bridges. Those funds will improve pedestrian access to the station. They say this is just one example of the infrastructure projects that will benefit the good people of Chester County. I feel an obligation as a member of Congress who serves on the Armed Services Committee to also make sure that I'm asking the right questions of the president. Why are we here right now? How did we get here? What decision tree process did we go to to the point where we are now here watching those images on TV? Congresswoman Chrissy Houlihan, Susan Wild, Mary Gay Scanlon, and Madeline Dean met with refugees who arrived yesterday. Houlihan said the refugees' treatment was an embodiment of American values. Chrissy Houlihan helped Berks County-based Fox Theaters and Phoenixville's iconic Colonial Theater obtain grant money after they originally had trouble securing it. To do more to support moms in the military. And the time is now to invest in paid family and medical leave. A Congresswoman Chrissy Houlihan hosting a hiring fair at the school. It'll feature more than 100 employers. And that is your 2021 year in review. As always, it is the honor and privilege of a lifetime to serve as your elected representative. Thank you.